Today I fucked up by wearing a shawl, which ruined my relationship with my GF. Minor background I am a pretty affectionate, and at times, effeminate, dude. I'm 6 feet 2 inches and have a pretty tough guy background in that I was in special forces a while ago, and my roommates all served as well, but I also have thin wrists and sit on my friends laps and blow kisses to them and shit. I'm not gay, I just am me. So while I was in a shop with a roommate a few weeks ago he saw these really cool shawls that we both couldn't get out of our heads he returned last weekend to buy them and now we have these shawls. Mine makes me look like a Star Wars character and his looks like the outlaw Hosei Wales, these are seriously awesome shawls. The first night we wore them, everybody at the dive bar we went to read dudes thought they were awesome as well. Then this girl and her friend arrive on invite from Shawl Bro and they are seriously turned off by our sweet shawls. Like, acting pretty weird about them and making comments. Whatever. So I get a call from my GF, she's tired and wants to hang out at mine, and so I bid these mean girls and shawl bro adieu and head home. I'm still wearing the shawl when my GF arrives and she's also really taken aback, she won't even kiss me until I take it off. We get do the deed and go to sleep and the next morning she starts asking me if I'm gay. And she's really serious and aggressive about it. I tell her I'm not, that if I was I'd definitely know if by now, and she counters with her major evidence of the fact that I own a shawl. Anyway she gets weird and leaves, and then sends me a text later about how she's sorry and that she needs to think about what kind of man she wants, and then doesn't contact me for days. So yesterday I invite her out. She's stumbling over her words and talking about how she likes tough guys and how she grew up in the south and needs to get used to the big city, but that she doesn't know this or that, and eventually I just tell her very politely to get fucked because I'm pretty insulted by this point. On the way back, now that I'm not directly in front of her, I get this long apologetic text from her but the crux of it is that yeah, she's just not that into me anymore because I wore a shawl. Later on, I tell shawl bro about this and he also had a blowout with the girl he was seeing over his shawl that very same night we went out. We are both going to keep wearing the shawls though, they are warm. TLD me and my friend bought cursed shawls and now we are single. X200B Edit She's a nice girl, she's just not picking up what I'm putting down. It's a silly thing to be mad about. And by popular demand it's shawl over for you hoes. Edit to shawl bro. It's official. That's the most I've heard seen the word shawl in a single day. We really need a picture of these awesome shawls. X200B. Edit OP delivered, picture of the shawl in his original post. Thanks. If you and Shawl Bro continue to sport shawls and get new, hotter girlfriends, you should call it Shawl's Hank Redemption. What the fuck? X200B. All this shawl talk and no pictures. They sound pretty close to Wild West ponchos, to me. X200B. Edit here he added a picture great shawls, too. I have. Shawl Envy. Give your balls a tug you titfucker. Shawlsy. So, where is the reddit tax of you two tough shawl bros in your shawls? I personally favor a nice neutral neutral colored thin poncho however poncho bro doesn't roll off the tongue as well. Edit vindication shawl tax achieved I shall sink into the shadows. Today my girlfriend fucked up by giving a shot shit about a shawl. FTFY. Shawls before dolls. I guess you could say both of those girlfriends were pretty shawl low. I'll see myself out. Where's the Tifu? I see this as an absolute win. Got a cool shawl, dropped a dummy. Sorry to hear man. But those are girls you don't want to be with, they like the image of you in their heads more than the you in reality. Also, deed good on YA being comfortable in your own skin, and also being self-aware enough to know how you deviate from cultural norms, but still being okay with that. 
Sounds like she wanted a reason to F off. I say where what makes you happy? There's a great Eddie Izzard who is an executive transvestite bit where he says he doesn't wear women's clothes. He wears his clothes. And he rocks it. So keep on rocking it. Keep being yourself and doing what you want. And seriously, have these girls never seen Israeli Middle Eastern military? They says shawls abound. Is this today I fucked up or dodged a bullet? As a knitter, I want to see pictures of the shawl. The shawl is a blessing in disguise because it exposed your girlfriend's questionable beliefs about masculinity. I think that by you wearing a shawl and being affectionate with your guy friends it just shows you are comfortable in your masculinity. My partner has the same qualities and I'm marrying him in two weeks. Get a new girlfriend. Doesn't sound like a fuck up to me. It sounds like a bullet dodged. This girl wasn't in love with you, she was in love with an idea that you happened to have fit well enough until she saw the shawl, at which point you no longer fit that idea. She basically fetishized you and didn't see you as a human being with a rich internal life. Instead she saw you as a G.I. Joe life-sized action figure. Go enjoy your shawls. Shawls are awesome. Heck, take it a step further and learn how to knit your own, so you can be swaddled in the warmest, most beautiful merino silk blend ever. Just say they are ponchos. X200B. And if ponchos aren't manly then fuck it, I am more woman than Oprah in all seriousness, those are blessed shawls of true perception. Likes macho men. Shawl looks like client Eastwood Westerns. Her logic makes perfect sense. It's 2019 and people still assume people's sexual preference based on clothes. Neat. More like blessed shawls that make people show their true selves. I'm of Indian decent, Punjab specifically. I wear shawls in the winter all the time. In fact, I own my grandfather's shawl that he also wore everywhere. I've been told multiple times, by multiple women, that they like this fact. I'm on the west coast. Sounds like you're on the east of the US? Is there such a big difference in cultures across the country? I'll have to keep that in mind if I ever move to the east I guess doubtful though. Did we just find Cam Newton's Reddit account? We need to see these shawls. If you like M, do you. Hope you find a girl that likes you for you, and not because of what you wear. So where can we get these shawls? Edit lol, this is the peak of my Reddit fame. TLD me and my friend bought cursed shawls and now we are single. I dunno, sounds like you've got a pretty sweet bromance going on. I mean, this is not a today I fucked up. Title should be like wearing a shawl which saved me from a relationship with a crazy, judgy person. Your shawl must be Kevlar because it saved you from that bullet. Fuck em. Wear what you want. They don't like it. Kick rocks. This definitely isn't a F.U. Man, look at Clint Eastwood in any of his western movies. If Clint isn't manly, I don't know who the fuck is. Shawl's ponchos are cool. Former marine here. I also have a shawl. It's fucking dope and I look like a fucking Jedi Assassin's Creed hybrid. Shawl bro, fuck her, keep your shit on lockdown. If she doesn't like a shawl then she probably doesn't like anything remotely cool. Find you a girl that'll wear one with you. Special forces. I have to ask. Not that I don't believe you, but most of the guys I know that I don't use that term. Need a little more before I call BS and you're some guy starting a shawl for guys company called Shawl Bros. Tell that dumb bitch I'm from the south and we even wear shawls while hunting so she can suck a chode on her opinion of what is and isn't.